Well, another way to protect the alcohol is to use like these reactants. So, um, a base, we need a base and then we need something like that can form a carbonyl compound that has a leaving group, a good leaving group, which is uh, a halide um, and an anhydrous solvent. Okay, so we form this acetal in blue. Okay, sorry. Um, okay, so let's write the mechanism of this reaction. So the first reaction is going to be, so re re remember we're using a very strong base, a hydride, it's a very strong base in presence of alcohol, uh, so the uh, pKa here is 16, however this, the pKa of this one is 35, so we're going to deprotonate, uh, we're going to use H- minus to deprotonate this hydrogen and form an alkylate, okay, so it is, we're, we're going to form this molecule, and a plus and after we're having minus h2 which is a gas okay um the gas h2 okay so the next step is going to be um the reaction between the alkali and something like like this let me just draw both forms o like this so we can delocalize this lone pair and uh, push like uh, the chlorine like to leave like we, we we form a leaving group so we can write this form like the form of a, an activated carbonyl compound so an, a, an activated carbonyl carbonyl compound is uh, actually a um, an oxygen that carries a positive charge okay so we form this carbonyl compound this alkylate right now is going to attack here and form an acetal. So the molecule that we are going to form is this one, like R O and an acetal. So let me draw this one in blue is this one, okay, with the oxygen. So this is what happened. And all this in yellow is all this actually, okay. Mm, well, <coughs> so here is another way to protect alcohol uh, as uh, an acetal, okay, 